Hey guys, I'm Avail back again with another video on this iPhone 12. If you have recently switched to an iPhone from Android, then you must be wondering how you can use custom ringtones without using iTunes. That means without paying anything. You can do this by using this GarageBand app. And no worries guys, you don't have to be a pro GarageBand user for this. I'll show you how you can do it using this app. So before we start, if you're new to my channel, then do hit the subscribe button to watch more videos. And if you've already subscribed, a big thank you to all of you guys. So let's get started. First of all, you have to download the music file that you would like to use as a ringtone. You can use the Chrome app or the Safari app, but make sure that you have saved the file on the phone, not on the cloud. And if you have saved the downloaded file on the phone, if you open the files app here, you will be able to see that file here in recent items. Now you can see that I have downloaded these audio files. Now after you have done that, you're ready to use this app GarageBand. Now let's open this GarageBand app. You can see these two tabs, click on tracks here. After that, simply scroll over to this on audio recorder. Okay, click here. After that, make sure that you have turned off this sign. Okay, this tempo, I believe. After that, you can set the length of your clip, the ringtone clip. Simply tap here, the plus sign here, and set the bars. Okay, suppose I'm setting it at 10. Done. Now, click here, these bricks here. Click here. Now you can see the mic sign here. Now you're ready to use the clip here. For that, you have to import that clip first. You know, click here, this omega sign. Okay, then files. Now you can see that I have already, you know, uh, exported certain items here now I can use this as well as I can export others as well for that you have to go to browse items now as I told you I have downloaded certain you know items here now if I just simply click here that item will be added there now suppose let me see if something is new here uh, yeah this one is new born a rockstar simply tap once like this and that will be added here on the list yeah, so you can see this born a rock star. Now suppose I'm using this audio. Okay, tap and hold and drag it like this and that will be on the track here. Okay, now I can play it. Now here you can decide which portion of this music or the sound or the song you'd like to use as you know ringtone and you can trim it or crop it. Suppose I'm going to use it from the start to this point. So for that what I can do I can crop it like this up to here and uh, I can set the bars accordingly. Suppose it is at 7. So 7 here. Okay. You can increase it or decrease it. Yeah. Suppose I'm going to adjust the bars here again the length. So let's keep it at six. Yeah, so that's adjusted accordingly. Now I'm ready with my clip. Now what you can do, there is one setting that I would like to share here. Go to settings here and you can use this fade out effect, okay? So towards the end, the music will be fade out. Like this. So you're done. Simply save it now. What do you have to do? Simply click here, this here, my songs, and this will be saved there. This is the clip that you have created now. Simply tap and hold here and you can rename it. You can share it where you will get the option to set it as ringtone first of all let's rename it okay now suppose it is my ringer 5 okay done now tap and hold again and share okay then ringtone click here after that click on export there you will get this option after this process is completed yeah, use sound as standard ringtone. Done. That's it. It's very simple, isn't it? Now you will be able to see this clip under your, you know, ringtone menu. Simply go to settings now. 
then sound and haptics ringtone there you will have these options suppose this is the one that we have just created right my ringer this one the fifth one similarly i have created others as well okay so this way you can actually add you know custom ringtones you know to use as your standard ringtone yeah if you don't like to use the default ones so what do you think about this i believe that it's very simple and what i have done uh, to make it simple i believe that it is going to work and if it does then let me know in the comments and if you end up liking my videos then do subscribe to my channel to watch more videos and till the next video guys cheers